The Australian researcher looking for far-reaching impacts of his country's recent wildfires noticed a change in the Emery Ice Shelf. Satellite images gathered by the IceSat-2 on its pole-to-pole orbit revealed an event that might have gone unnoticed. Right in midwinter, when you're expecting everything to just stay really cold and frozen and not much going on, especially anything involving water in liquid form, and then bang, a lake drained. And we would not have known about it had it not been for um, the benefit of satellite observations. 21 to 26 billion cubic feet of water poured into the ocean under the ice shelf. That's enough to tower over the skyscrapers of a huge portion of central New York City. Fricker says a fissure likely opened up in the ice under the lake. Once the water escaped, the ice cover fell and then was pushed back up, creating a rise in the ice. Fricker says a satellite is constantly gathering data on ice shelves in both Antarctica and Greenland. So this capability that we've shown with ISAT2 is going to help us learn about meltwater systems all around um, both ice sheets. Fricker says understanding processes like these will help scientists improve their models, which aim to predict what will happen to the ice shelf under different circumstances. The findings are published in the journal Geophysical Research Letters. Eric Anderson, KPBS News.